good evening students so today we'll continue the video for chapter 1 class 6 mathematics okay so last time i have teach you which number is in which place according to the indian system okay so this number 3 if you are asked so in which place this digit 3 will stands in the table here obviously we'll start from the right side so this will be in the ones place isn't it so if you write in the one place we'll write the digit 3 similarly what will be this digit 4 it will be in the tens place so we'll write 4 in the tens place and so on okay so this 5 will be in the hundred place what about this 4 so ones tens hundred thousand okay see i told you to remember this table okay it's very simple you have to go in this way ones tens hundred thousand ten thousand leg ten leg crore ten crore okay if it is there but in this number here we we did not have crore so i did not make it here but if a number is very large and crore is there we have to write crore also okay so this four will be in the thousand place what about this three in the ten thousand place and this seven will be in the leg place we don't have ten legs so we'll just leave it empty so if you are to, to, told to write this number in words how will you write that means if you see this seven is in the leg place so you can say that 7 lakh 34,543 okay you can write in yourself okay 7 lakh 34,543 hope you understand students if you have any problem you try to enquire okay with me if you have your number or anything even in the comment section if this video is uploaded in youtube okay now let's see how do we put commas okay in a number if a number is given how do we insert commas because simply we cannot write very long uh, number and read it out isn't it we have to have a sequence of reading otherwise it is very difficult to read out so let's see if you are given this type of number and you are told to insert commas. See, in Indian system, we used to insert in 3, 2, 2 system. Okay, 3, 2, 2 means, see, I'll tell you. After starting from the right hand corner, the first comma will be after the first three digits. 1, 2, 3. That means the first comma will be after 4 then what will be the, where will be the next comma i told you the process should follow 3 2 2 isn't it so see after 3 will go for the next two that is 1 2 your second comma will be here okay see after this also we have to go for 2 isn't it 3 2 2 that means we have done 3 2 the next one will be here but see this since 7 is the first digit we don't need to put any comma here because we don't have any other digit here okay so we don't need we'll stop here now we'll try to read the number so i told you this is in ones place ones tens hundred thousand ten thousand lakh ten lakh so how will you read this is in the lakh 73 is in the lakh 74 is in thousand and this three to one is in hundred place so how will you read 73 lakh 73 lakh 74,000 sorry this number you write it in words okay 74,321 21 okay in this way you write a number in expanded form okay now let's see one more example if you are given other number 3 2 8 4 2 3 6 now you are told to insert commas and write the number and write the number in words how will you do especially for this indian system okay i'm talking here indian system so i told you we have to follow the 3 2 2 rule so first starting from the right hand corner the first comma will be in the third place 1 2 3 the first comma will come here so it will mark the thousand okay since i told you once tens hundred thousand so this number 
along with this comma will mark the thousand place what the next where will be the next comma where will be the next comma students after two digits isn't it three two two you have to go that means first first comma was here second will be after two digit one two so what will be where will be the next comma after two digits again that means it will be here but see i told you there is no other number here so we don't need to insert the commas isn't it how how will you do how will you insert comma here have you ever seen comma like this never but if a number example a number was here seven was here example so that time you have to insert okay three two two will come in this process but seven is not here at this moment so we don't need to insert here so how do you see this number now right in words 32 32 lakhs isn't it ones tens hundred thousand ten thousand lakh ten lakh so this 32 is in lakh this is in 84 is in hundred sorry thousand and uh, this 236 is in hundred place so you can compare with the table okay which i have already given in the last video ones tens hundred thousand compare it okay so now we can write 32 lakh 84,236 in words, okay? Hope you can write it yourself. I will leave it to you as a homework. Mm, okay. Now, if you are given a number, now we have to, in expanded form, okay? We will try to, okay, wait. I will first tell you how to keep the numbers in, in commas in international system. Let's see. Another number is here. 3, 2, 6, 7, 8, 4, 3, 2, okay? However, a number is here. Now, you are told to put commas and write the number in international form. How will you do? I told you, Indian system follows 3, 2, 2 rule, but the international system follows 3, 3, 3 rule, okay? So, the first comma from the right hand will come, from the right side will come after 3 digits. That means, 2, 3, 4, 1, 10, 100. After this first three digit, the first comma will come. Similarly, where will the second comma come? After another three digits. Three, 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 we have to follow, isn't it? So, one, two, three, this is the first comma. One, two, three, this is the second comma. Okay. So, can we put one more comma here? Let's see. One, two, three. But there is no other number, so we'll leave it like this. Okay. No comma is possible right now. So, how will you, for international system, how will you compare? How will you write the number in words? So if you compare that with the table, okay. Now this time let me make you compare so that for your better understanding you can compare with the table. See, this is the table I have given you for international system, isn't it? Now we have already inserted the commas. So now we'll make it right in words. See, this is two will be in ones place, three will be in tens place, and four will be in the hundred place, isn't it? Ones, tens, hundred. So this 432 is where? In the 100 place. What about this 678? Let's see. After 1, 10, 100, we see that it is 1000, 10,000 and then 100,000. So this 8 will represent 1000, 7 will represent 10,000 and uh, lastly 100,000. 6. So what is this 678 representing? thousand isn't it since we are writing these three digits in this form that means it is in the thousands place lastly about this 32 so 2 will represent after 100,000 what are we having 1 million so this 2 will represent 1 million and this 3 will represent 10 million so we can see that this 32 is in the millions place according to the table do we have any billions here no other number so we don't have any billions okay so we leave it like this now you are told to write in words how will you write 32 millions isn't it 32 million 6078 and lastly, 400, 
32. Hope you understand students. If you have any difficulty, you can comment down in the video and ask for your queries. Okay. So this was in the international form and this was in the Indian form. Okay. Remember in Indian form, how do we keep the comma starting from the right hand side? 322 form. And in the international system, how do we put the commas? 333 form. Okay. Simple to remember. Okay, students. So we'll stop the video here for today. And then in the next class, we'll start with exercise 1.1. Thank you.